Hello and welcome to EV's Classroom. In today's video, we will be talking about Azure AI Speech Services. Azure Speech Services is a powerful tool from Microsoft that helps absent devices understand and speak to users. It can turn speech into text, read text out loud in natural sounding voices and even translate languages in real time. With easy integration, high accuracy and customization options it's designed to make interactions with technology more human-like and accessible for everyone. So now let's get into deploying Azure AI Speech Services on Microsoft Azure. So what you have to do is go to the Azure portal and to your subscription and then go ahead and click on create a resource and search for Azure Speech Services. So hit on enter and it will give you this speech gonna click on that and make sure you select the speech plan and hit on create and it will take you to the creation page so here I'm gonna create a new resource group called um, learning speech DMP it stands for temporary because I'm gonna delete it later on and then I'm gonna select a name for this so I will give the name as learning each one and for the region I will go with West US so in West US I will be able to use the speech avatar we'll talk more about that later so I'm gonna go for the standard one instead of the free but if you view the full pricing details in the free edition you get five hours of audio free and you will be limited for that but when you go for the standard edition you pay one dollar per hour so it's a good deal to pay one dollar per hour so i'm going to stick with that so i'm gonna go ahead and choose the pricing tier standard if you want you can go with free pricing tier you will have all the features but you, your number of hours will be limited so next i'm gonna go to networking tab and leave it as default leave the rest as default identity and tags and just go for review and create once you are in review and create it will finalize the settings you have made and when, once it's validated hit on create So you will get the notification that the deployment is been submitted to Azure. Now you can see the deployment progress over here. And once it's deployed, hit on go to resource. And then on the overview page, you can select on go to speech studio. And I will hit on that. Make sure you select your Microsoft account if prompted and then as you can see here there are speech to text and text to speech so what we are going to talk about in this video is text to speech and inside of text to speech the audio content creation so I will click on that so here what I can do is I can make new files that means text files so I can put different text into it and make an AI model speak it out so I'm gonna hit on new text file so I'm gonna enter something here so before entering anything I want to tell you something about this interface so here on the right side you got the settings this voice settings and recent files I guess and silence types pronunciation and etc and on the top you have the file operations like save or export you can export to an Azure blob as well as your local storage in your machine and that's almost it and here play and pause also we'll get into it so I'm gonna type hi 
How are you doing today? I am an AI model deployed side of Microsoft Azure AI speech services. So from here, I'm going to select a voice. So there are many voices to choose from. I'll just preview a couple of voices for you. So this is one voice. We look forward to working with you. I'm not going to go with that. So let's try Brandon. It seems clear that SpaceX has a significant lead over its competitors in the commercial space industry. What about Jacob? Scientific studies have evaluated surgical masks, but relatively few have looked at whether cloth masks can stop virus transmission. I'm going to go with Brandon for this. So I will hit on confirm. Now, what I have to hit is play. So it will process Hi, this. how are you doing today? I am an AI model deployed inside of Microsoft Azure AI speech services. Okay, that sounds great. So I can select the audio quality from here as well. And then um, let's mess with the settings a bit. So if we go into settings, we can see the break. So here we can add breaks. So make sure you select the text. Select it all. And if you want to select a part of it, just select a part of it. So here I'm going to select all of it. And then I'm going to hit add silence type. So I want him to stop at commas and full stops, the break of paragraphs and etc. So I can select a silence type from here. I will select sentence boundary. So it adds silence between adjacent sentences. I will make him stop for three seconds maybe or two seconds. So I will put 2000 milliseconds and I will hit on apply. And also at a comma, he should stop for one second. So comma exact. I'm gonna one second. All right. So let's see how he says it now. Hi, how are you doing today? I am an AI model deployed inside of Microsoft Azure AI speech services. Hmm. It looks like it's better if we slow him down. So what you have to do to slow the voice down is once again, select all and then go for rate. Rate is the rate at which words are spoken in. So I'm going to put it at around zero or let's say, yeah, 0 0.95. Now I'm going to hit on apply and we'll see how it turns out. Hi, how are you doing today? I am an AI model deployed inside of Microsoft Azure AI speech services. That's how you change the rate, and you can also change the pitch of it, like make his voice a bit rough. So I'm gonna make it to 0 0.95 once again, and hit on play. Hi, how are you doing today? I am an AI model deployed inside of Microsoft Azure AI speech services. Just like that, you can do it. And the volume as well. So you already know what what volume does. It just changes the volume. So I'm gonna leave it as default. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a conversation. So I can make Brandon say hi. How are you doing today? And next we'll put a different voice model. Let's put Jenny. So Jenny says, I am doing good. What about you? So once again, Brandon says, mm, let's say, are you going to see the game tonight? So let's make Jenny see, say, um, yes, I love playing and watching basketball. Good ball. All right. So let's make this conversation. Hi. How are you doing today? 
I am doing good, what about you? Are you going to see the game tonight? Yes, I love playing and watching basketball. So that's how you make a conversation inside of Sweet Studio. It's very fun and there are more features to discover. So once you are done with making this, make sure you hit on save and you can name it let's name it as uh, basketball why not and location i will put in all files just save and then it will be saved so you can come back later and check on your files edit it and do those stuff so that's how we make a conversation and also you could export so you can export to an audio library and you can also export to the local disk when you hit on next it will just get downloaded so here you can select what to export the audio only or you need the plain text as well so you, there are different audio qualities to uh, select from there's 48k that means it's the highest quality available and you can hit on export once you are satisfied with making the speech and it will be exported into your local disk it will just be downloaded as a normal file so that's all for speech studio actually there are more features to discuss about so i'm gonna go ahead and show you something like a bonus one i'm gonna go back to speech studio and then head over to text-to-speech avatar make sure you deploy this in a selected validated region it only supports west us2 and a couple of more regions i guess so here you can once you're in this tab you can um try it out and then you can say hello viewers how are you doing today do you enjoy using Microsoft Azure AI text to speech services? All right. So once I'm done writing it, I'm going to hit on preview video and it will render you a video. So you can select from different avatars over here as we can see there's only a couple of avatars available but in the future i hope more will be added as you can see this runs on python basically you don't have to mess with the code so still the video is being made right now we can see i'll hit on play Hello viewers, how are you doing today? Do you enjoy using Microsoft Azure AI text-to-speech services? Okay, that's all. So I encourage you to go and check out more features in Azure AI Speech Studio. There are tons of features to discover and you can train your own models, even you can make your own custom voice inside of it. So I, go, I encourage you to go ahead and try it out by your own. It's the best way to learn something. And that's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. We'll come back with more content about Azure OpenAI. Thanks for watching. We'll see you back next time.